Good morning, good afternoon, family. Welcome, welcome. How y'all living today? How you feeling today? Have you checked your mental pulse today? I want to bring this story to you. This really is concerning me because a lot of people go through their whole life without seeing um, any plane crashes. And so I, because I bear witness to three of them right here in Wisconsin, um, and I don't live by an airport, I think one time I did, but I don't live by an airport. But this is something that seems to happen quite frequently in Wisconsin. I mean, I mean, are we a no-fly zone or what? Anyway, and this happened in my old stumping town. A fatal plane crash in Watertown, Wisconsin, claimed the life of a 73-year-old pilot and his eight year old grandson joining him for a flight up northern Wisconsin. Damn. The aircraft plunged into a grove of trees at the Brant Quick Park near residential area on Wednesday at approximately 9 a.m. And so investigators spent much of the uh, day Thursday at the site where pieces of the wreckage were spread all across the soccer field. The National Transportation Safety Board and the Aviation Administration uh, were at the airport hangar to examine the evidence of this fatal crack, collision, crash. According to the uh, Federal Aviation Administration, the plane had just taken off from a municipal airport about three miles from the incident site. Sources say the flight was planned to Manitowish waters. Investigators will collect as much information as they can from witnesses and the wreckage itself to determine if they can what led to this family tragedy in Watertown. Um, Watertown Police Department said that Brant Quick Park will remain closed throughout the weekend um, for the site cleanup. Poli police have yet to identify the victim, saying only that there were two victims. And the WISN 12 has contacted the family, who didn't wish to comment. The pilot is from Watertown and his grand son is from Waukesha. Oh my God. Oh Lord. Oh my goodness. Let me say this. One time I was just driving down Mill Road. And for those of y'all who know where Mill Road is, I was going east down Mill Road. And I was saying to myself, damn it, that, that uh, plane is getting a little low. And when I got to like 60th, not too, uh, in Mill Road, there's a big open field. And I, if Tommy is listening, he can bear witness to this right here. It's a big, like, it's an industrial area. So when you're going down, there's a, you know, a lot of open space. So obviously the person tried to guide the plane that way. So I'm driving down, and I'm saying to myself, damn, that uh, plane is looking low. And by the time I got, mm, you know, like I said, coming up on 60th, a little past it, the damn plane fell into the ditch and set it for fire. And I'm looking to my left, and I can see it right there in my... Uh, right out the window. I was like, oh, it was like a movie. And it seemed like it fell down in slow motion. Okay? Now, if that wasn't bad enough, when I was in Watertown, living in Watertown, this is in the count of, uh, this is in Jefferson County. Okay? So, I don't know how far Milwaukee County and Jefferson County are from each other, um, but maybe it's about 45 minutes. Right. And the damn 
plane fell down right on the highway, I-94. What the hell is going on? That was the second one. <laughs> this is no joke. I mean, I wish I was kidding. And the third one was the same thing. It's, I saw it fall out the air. And I couldn't see where it landed because, you know, there was a, a, a lot of buildings and stuff in the way. The point I'm trying to make is this, so, this is very sad to me simply because why does it keep happening? I don't hear about people in different places. Um, you know, you hear about major crashes or whatever, but this particular state has a lot of small craft, aircraft crashes all over the place, falling into the cities. What is going on up in the air, y'all? And for those of y'all who live in Wisconsin or Milwaukee or Jefferson or Racine, below anywhere, have, what have y'all experienced? And what y'all think about this? Have y'all even paid attention? One of them crashed on somebody's house up there on Good Hope Road. This is not, what is this? Okay. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's me. Why am I straight? If you like what you hear, please subscribe, share the channel. Um, and I'm going to see you in the next video.